Hi everyone, <coughs> Lawrence from Insania Musica here. Um, continuing on with uh, building large orchestral orchestral templates um, using a MacBook Pro with a small CPU and small RAM compared to like the large studio systems you can buy. So where we got to last time was built uh, a large template. Um, I was using the East West Play engine. So what I would do is um, initiate the plugin, um, put all the sounds I wanted in, give them auxiliary buses, the whole thing, and then eliminate the plugin, and all you're left with is the um, kind of skeleton template. Save that, and it does save you a lot of time um, when you're working. Um, sure, you don't have everything loaded up, but at least you have your template there, so you can go, okay, that's what I'm going to use next, and then go through the loading process. So uh, here's the uh, template that I ended up with. And as you can see, oops, fairly large and fairly standard, long, shorts, brass, percussion, the whole thing. Um, so I did get to the point though, I've been using um, some contact samples um, from a company called Cine Samples, and they're like orchestral beds, fantastic. Um, and I could add them to the templates, so I've got them on board. Um, but I've got to thinking that, wow, th with every kind of variation I can have here, um, this template's going to end up being enormous. So was there another way of being able to call this up as a basic template and then as I'm working thinking, gee, the Cine sample samples would work well here, how could I load them quickly and easily um, without having to go through this massive setup? Um, and after trying to do um, channel strips and everything like that, I finally came up with uh, this solution which is working for me at the moment you might like to try this and it's how you add um, tracks and elements and settings from other songs and other templates I'll go to my browser and I'll go home um, I'll do a search I'm going to do a search in the search box here I'm pointing to a search in the search box here Cine samples I apologize it's not C-I-N-I -I samples it's C-I-N-E samples there's a link just down there to where they are um, it's just a quick way of finding stuff. So here, if you have a look, full rack orc, um, that's the template that I made. So I've made just a template for Cine samples, um, and then save that, uh, and now I'm going to call in from it. So come down here, there's the import button. Now you can do this with any song you've created or any template you've created. Um, you just find the song with the template, come to the import button, and now you can see I've got low chords, 2D, output load, all my auxiliaries here, everything like that. So let's highlight all, just select. So that was just Shift A and select everything. Click off it so that it's not highlighted anymore. Now the things I don't want is I don't want the output and I don't want the master because I've already got them built into my template so I don't want to add extra ones. Um, so everything is selected apart from that. I hit add. And what's happening now is um, logic is going to that other other song or other template finding out what it needs to know and importing them straight in and now if you have a look I come down here to low chords as you can see it's set up my auxiliaries so auxiliary 104, 506 it's named everything for me I've got um, track icons and I don't know if you can hear that So if I go to my other ones. And I go to these ones. So there they are, all added into my template. Um, quick and easy. So if you make up um, a whole heap of different templates for um, the way I've done here with the Cine samples, or you can have um, special groups or percussion sets or um, band sets or all those different sorts of things um, that you don't want to keep them in the template but you want to keep them available to you really quickly um, by using the import um, from external song or external template is a really really quick way of being able to build um, this kind of functionality in. So it's helping my workflow 
hopefully it may help yours. Till next time, I'll see you soon.